Hey guys and welcome to the channel. Today, Watch Out is one year old. I started this channel on November 26, 2022 and posted my first video on the 1st of December. The reason for starting this channel was simple. I was and am obsessed with watches and my girlfriend was bored of hearing me talk about them all the time. So I decided to bore all of you instead. Now one year, 65 videos and almost 3000 subscribers later, here we are. I'm so grateful to every single one of you who watches my videos and especially to those of you who have subscribed to the channel. You know, I actually enjoy interacting with every one of you through YouTube, Instagram or even in real life. By the way, I read every single comment on the channel and try to respond to each one. But sorry if I ever missed yours. My goal with this channel is not only to present the best content that I can but also to be completely transparent with you. Also, you know that I'm not trying to sell anything to you like many other watch reviewers, so you can rest assured that my reviews are unbiased. Most importantly, almost all the watches I've reviewed so far have been bought with my own money. So the thoughts expressed in my videos are my own as a real customer and are not influenced by any brand trying to promote their products. And the team behind the channel is mostly just me. My girlfriend is sometimes the camera woman or hand model, very unwillingly let me tell you. But for the most part, it's just a one-man team. Lastly, most of the videos I make are just because I get a new watch, want to try it out and share my thoughts with anyone interested in listening to it. So in the spirit of transparency, I thought I would share the channel stats with you, including the number of views, impressions, and lastly, the revenue generated through the channel after one year. As of December 1st, my channel has received 8.4 million impressions and over 1 million views on YouTube. Impressions are the number of people who have seen my video thumbnail on YouTube, while views are the number of people who have actually watched the video. It's insane to me that my videos have received over 1 million views. I didn't expect these numbers, especially in the first year of the channel. So thanks a lot you guys. Now my average click through rate is only about 9%. That's the number of people who actually click on a video after seeing the thumbnail. Now this is far from impressive, but I'm satisfied with it because I don't make clickbait thumbnails for the most part. The thumbnails are usually accurate representations of my thoughts. Now most of my viewers are from the US, India and UK. And almost half the viewers fall in the 25 to 34 age category. Finally coming on to the stat that you're most interested in. How much did YouTube pay me for 1 million views? Well, not too much at all. I only got monetized in June of this year and I've made around $370 since. So on average, I'm making about $60 a month through the channel. My average RPM or revenue per 1000 views is $1.09 for long form content and a mind blowing 4 cents per thousand views for shorts. Absolutely terrible. <laughs> Still, 370 sounds like a decent amount, right? But that will start to change when I tell you how much time and effort goes into making one video. Let me clarify, I do this just for fun and not with the intention of making money through YouTube. But to put things into perspective, here's the breakdown. To make just a 10 minute video, it takes me 3 to 4 hours of research, 3 to 4 hours of filming, 6 to 8 hours to write and refine the script, and 1 to 2 hours to record audio. Lastly, it takes me 6 to 8 hours to edit and publish the video. So on average, any 10 minute video takes me anywhere between 20 to 24 hours of dedicated effort. While a short takes me around 5 hours to produce from start to finish. This means that at least 1000 hours of work has gone into the channel so far. That's as many hours as JLC puts into testing one of their watches. The result for them is a watch that's priced at $10,000. For me, the result is $370. If you look at it this way, I'm just making about 30 cents an hour through YouTube. The minimum wage in the US is $7.25 an hour or 20 times more than what I make. Or 20 times more than what I make. I've spent more money on the channel than I care to admit and I also did a giveaway a few months ago and will probably do a few more in the future. Perhaps when we hit 5000 or 10,000 subscribers. 
but this is still cool because i don't do this to make money i do it because i feel passionate about it the only thing i ask from you in return is a like and a subscribe it's free for you but helps me with the youtube algorithm a more liked video is more likely to be shown to more people but anyway it's still been so much fun to have this channel and make these videos the channel also gives me an excuse to buy a new luxury watch baby please don't worry the watch is not for me it's for the channel i swear now in this one year i've had the chance to make videos with some incredible watches and it's been quite the ride but let me tell you this is just the beginning and there's so much more to come in fact i have all these videos in various stages of completion you should see them all in the next couple of months so do subscribe and if you enjoyed this video please boop that like button that will really help me make more than 30 cents an hour also let me know if there are any watches or any topics you'd like me to cover in future videos and i'll do my best to work on them thanks a lot and i'll see you all in the next video very soon